and you've decided to get yourself a glass of water. So imagine in your mind's eye that you're trotting into your kitchen, pulling the glass out of the cupboard, pouring the water. Wouldn't it be nice to have some lemon in the water? So you pop out to your garden and you happen to have a big tree full of lemons. They are so ripe and juicy and fat, plump lemons. You could pick the whole tree, they're all just ready to go. Take some time and just pick your favourite lemon. Pick a lemon for your glass of water. As you're walking inside with your lemon, smell the lemon. The zest is kind of sparking, splashing your face. Grab the chopping board and a knife and cut open the lemon. Cut it into quarters. Now throw one of them into your glass of water and grab a piece, grab one wedge and put it up to your lips and lick with your tongue around the inside of the lemon. Now crunch down on that lemon. Crunch down and suck that sour taste into your mouth and feel the juice of the lemon roll down the back of your throat. Can anybody taste the, le the lemon? Is anybody salivating? <laughs> okay, you can open your eyes now. Did anybody not start glaring a watery mouth? Everyone watering? <laughs> you just have a thought about it. That's how powerful the mind is. You can actually literally get your body to have a physical reaction to what you are thinking about. Doesn't that just give you goosebumps? <laughs> like I've kind of got that going on. Because when we put ourselves into alignment with what we want, when we are focused on what we want in our life, we radiate and actually have that experience in our body of that actual thing. So this can be used on a hugely large scale. If we